my typical day, I would usually get up around 10, 11, and then I will go into the university to do some of my coursework. My day usually starts around 9 to 10 o'clock, that's when I wake up. Usually I try and get in to campus by 10 o'clock just to get all my work done before dinner time if I can. Tutorials informatics is kind of a different thing from the classes you usually have in high schools. It's the format is usually one person, a tutor, who leads several students, sometimes 10 or 20 students, in a small classroom. And uh, tutors and students will talk about different problems, and it's usually very rewarding. Especially in later years, you get to choose from whatever you want, and I'm really passionate about what I chose. Lecturers are usually great people and they really get the, the message along quite nicely. The lectures are really interesting and interactive. My teaching is made up of lectures, which is very often sitting down and trying to take everything in if I can. Then I've got my tutorials, which are a better opportunity to ask questions and kind of learn with your tutor. And then I have my labs, which is very often speaking to my friends, trying to work on our coursework together and help each other out a bit. I am currently the president of the uh, Robotics Society here at Edinburgh. Uh, what we do is we try to teach beginners how to um, build robots and sort of do hardware programming. I am a member of Comsoc. It's the Computing Society, everything related to computer science. And I am also a member of the German Society where I get to practice my German. There are usually many events across the campus, so you don't need to be a member of society to join their events. So I would encourage everyone to join different events across campus. I founded a new sports club, the Parkour Club, and I'm the president of the club. It's grown from two of us who started it last year to having more than 30 members. I'm a member of CompSoc, which is the computing society here at the University of Edinburgh, and they host regular events, people coming in from Google or Amazon or smaller software companies around Edinburgh, and they can host talks and talk about what they actually do in their workplace and what kind of engineering tasks they carry out. I'm a member of the Edinburgh University Tango Society. In my free time, I practice dancing. I set up a society called Ed Intelligence. It's about AI and machine learning. What we do is we basically want to bring anything kind of related to artificial intelligence, machine learning, deep learning to the people here. That means it's going to be research talks, it's workshops where you can hands-on practice what you're doing, it's things where people from the industry come along. One of my favorite spots around university is the George Square Park. It is a little bit of nature surrounded by the university campus buildings and when the sun is out, you can just escape all the rush of the day for at least a little moment. Sometimes if I'm um, feeling like rewarding myself, I go to Ransacked Oven, which is um, opposite Informatics Forum or Checkpoint to have dinner or lunch or cake. My favourite lunch spot is a little wrap place just across from Appleton Tower. It's called um, Nile Valley Wrap and they have the best wraps for four pounds. I'll go to lunch with my friends, typically at the Nile Valley Cafe. I sometimes go to the local cafes and I found quite a nice uh, cafe called The Forest Cafe, which is a volunteer run place, super nice food. Went there yesterday, it was delicious. There is a spot in the main library called Ucreate Studio. Ucreate is a great hangout for makers. Uh, it contains 3D printers, uh, laser cutters, and those things can help you make really cool things um, to then show off to your friends. After classes, if I'm feeling very motivated, I go to the library. In reality, I often just go to the pub with my friends. <laughs> Hanging out with friends is always fun, watching films, uh, finding time to fit in that around the studies is definitely important. I sometimes go trampolining and bowling. The visits to Fairbush were always quite exciting and interesting. 
and it was so much to do. I mean, after three days, it would be, I would be feeling knackered, but um, I, I can't complain about that. We'll go to TV, maybe play some pool, have some pints. I kind of split my time between the two. If I was here, I was studying, um, or on the rare occasion, socializing with uni friends, and if not, I was kind of back in my neighborhood doing things over there. I exercise quite regularly at the uni gym at Pleasants. I also go to the cinema quite often. This is a cinema called The View, down at the Omni Center, which is only like a 10-15 minute walk from here. Most of my free time I do spend dancing, so that's really my hobby here, and my social life as well.